Okay, hi, welcome to a Scratch My Pie um, video. Now this is a new one for me. It's basically, it's um, a Morse code receiver, um, central and transmitter. It's linked to two Arduinos. Um, there's an infrared receiver between one of them. And at the moment, um, the infrared light is off. And so the analog zero is receiving is on high, 1020. Um, if the infrared goes on, it goes down to zero. Um, so effectively, what it's doing is it's sending a dot or a dash at the moment. Um, the code is here. Wait until, so with the receiver, wait until the value is zero. Let's see, go over here first. So we've got three at the moment, short and long, dot and dash. So the short code turns two on. One of them's infrared, one of them's a red light. Waits half a second and then turns them both off. The L1, similar, but it's wait for one second. And the space bar, wait for two seconds. Um, effectively, what happens is, is that when the value becomes zero, it will then start timing, like a pulse timer and then wait till it gets to um, goes over a thousand it then checks the delay like the pulse sent um, if it's a short delay we um, you know an s was sent if it's a long delay we know that a um, an l was sent and we've got number one as well if it's a very long delay we know that's the end that's the space bar we know that's the end of the um, letter being sent now what's the good thing here is is that I've made a variable called letter sent and basically every time you it gets a pulse, it gets, it gets a short or a long, it adds that to the variable letter sent, so it goes S L S L. Um, once it knows it's finished, it then broadcast check letter. In the check letter section, I've got two lists of the um, two lists up. Uh, one list is letters A through to Z. The other one is, um, I'll show you actually, if it's variables. Um, blah, 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 list, letters, and Morse. So the letters code A to Z. Morse is the SL, LSS, the, the short code dot, dash, dot, 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 for the different, um, for the different um, letters. Basically, it then just goes through the list and it just checks until on the list is found the, um, the letter that corresponds to the code that's being sent. A um, lot of talk, not a lot of action. So I'll get it going now. I'll make it big on here. So the key things to look out for is the, if I see it all off now, these two things here, the letter sent is what we sent over in, in dot, dot, dash, dot, dot and the letter received is what it thinks it received. So I'm going to press an S and it knows that was the short code. Sent an S over, delay was only half a second. It knows that is, that was an S short code. Long, it knows it was a long delay, sent over and that's a long. So now it's going to S and L. I'm going to put an S in. And it was short delay, SLS. If I press spacebar now, that will end my letter. And now we want to finish and send over an R. And if I look in my code, hopefully on Morse code, SLS should correspond to R. In fact, you know what? I know it does. So here we go. SLS. Is R short, long, short. So show it again. Go over here, sorry, go over here. So make it bigger. Clear it off. Press uh, S. Press another S. Press another S. Short, 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 dot, dot, dot. Press space bar. And that's the wrong known one for short. S as in SOS. Um, so this is a working in progress. The ultimate aim, I suppose, is to see if it can do 
words um, so we sent it over and then it knows when the words being finished and also I suppose um, we can type just basically press in a letter S and it will send over the dot 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 or the dash 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 um, all by itself that kind of sounds complicated um, but the great thing about it is there's two Arduinos uh, one a sender and one a receiver and it's basically it's just measuring the pulse of the um, of the receive things as well um, thanks for watching bye